Alright, hello, and welcome to stream 11 of Clicky's Hen House, creating a 3D theme park environment scene from scratch. Again, I had a long delay in uploads, you know the drill, I'm an anxious little bitch. Whatever. Alright, let's just go right into this. Uh, turn off the thumbnail. Basically, I'm going to try and go for as long as I can before I just can't go anymore. Anxious, short stream, you know the drill. Right, let's get on to this. So, we're going to start off where we left off again and continue modeling this roof here. So we just need to get over the like face. I figured out, the. by the way, that problem I had, managed to fix it just by restarting. I also managed to figure out what the hell happened to cause the problem in the first place, which is nice. So we hopefully won't be encountering that problem again. I'll try and see if I can get the round about the same uh, shape. So I want to go multi cut. I want to go about that big. Select that face. And we will extrude over here. So how am I going to fix the problem that plagued me during my last problem? Simple. I am not going to uh, I am not going to edit the pivot point of these faces because that's what caused the problem last time. Now that I know that, I won't do it again. If that's flat, right. Move this over here and make it a square again, so about like that. Face. And we'll extrude all the way over here. Move it all the way. We can go all the way over here to make sure we really get it lined up. Oops, I want to move that, move that back. The timeline is not important for what we're doing. Move it like so. There we go. Nice. Now all we need to do is go all the way over here again. Multi-cut. Make it about square-ish. It's like the face, get that. Oops, I want to extrude, move over. Now we're going to do with something slightly different. Gonna move it into here. I'm going to go multi cut. I'm going to go. Make it perfectly in line with that. That's good. Select those. Select these edges. Oops. Uh, select these edges. Yeah, like so. Off oh, the love of God. Why aren't you selecting that one? Okay, it's not gonna... Whatever. Hmm. Okay, there we go. That's better. Face. Move that back. What we're gonna do is delete that face. And we're going to select that face and delete it. The entire object, control one. What we're gonna do I'm going to go to Vertex, like that and that, and we want to want to merge those, merge that, merge that, and merge that. And if that works, if we go to Vertex and do a group select. One Vertex selected. Alright, cool. So that did work. Now what we're going to do, 
to the underside of this. Actually, what we're first going to do, control D. Going to centerize the pivot. Move it upwards. Make it smaller. Like. Make it. Ah, I believe I've done a bit of an oopsie. I want to delete that. It's like this. Yeah. Right, what we're going to do first. We're going to get the multi-cut, multi-cut here, multi-cut here, get the face tool, get that. and move it upwards like so. There we go. Nice, 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 nice. Right now, what we're going to do, let's select all of this, go into one, select all the fa these faces, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. I only have fourteen, and we're going to click delete them. Basically, the reason why is that we never see them, we're never supposed to see them, so we delete them, so, like so, and that's nice. Now what we need to do is add get a nice little cube, move it all the way over here, get a bit larger, and move it over here-ish. want to select that, we want to make it bigger again, move it over, and we're going to make it go like that, like so, not so wide, make it thicker, that's what we're going to do, it's like that, new, move it all the way over here, Multi-cut, cut there, face, move it over, like so, multi-cut, like so, like the face tool again, oops, crap, extrude all the way out like so, I like that. Uh, thank you, William is cool. It's nice to be streaming again, yeah. Uh, cut again here. Face. Make sure one select tool. Extrude again. Uh, out to here. And move it in so it's square like that. Multi cut. Like that face like that, move it over like so, move it in, that right, it's not exact, damn it, it's not square so we'll just go slightly inwards, we'll multi-cut, face, and we will move it over into this, like so. move it slightly outwards, like so, there we are, and select this, move it slightly back, there, like that, there you go, now what we're going to do, let's select, let's, okay, we're going to control one this, and now we're going to select these faces. Whoops. So we should have. So we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Delete. 
because we don't see that never see those so they don't need to exist like so like that and what we're going to do is going to grab another cube and do pretty much the same thing move it over here oops move it uh woods get a bit bigger make it a bit smaller make it fit into the spe into what we made like that move it over it's a bit too thick so we'll make it thinner uh, move it a bit over. Man, we've got something like that. Actually. Basically, we want to make it the same as that down there, so we'll do this. You go like that. Face. Ah, crap. Object, we want this one's face, so like just move it over there. Move this. make that square like so it's like this and make that square like so then we just need to multi cut so we get multi cut tool out like so like that and then we extrude make it sure it's square there we are. Make sure that's square. It is. Cool. Then we just need to go. It's like this one again. Control one. Face. Like that. And that. Delete. And now. We're making progress. We've got a roof done. L O. I don't know what else. I was trying to spell nice, but I absolutely stuffed that up. So. Yeah, like that. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's pretty good looking. Alright, what's next? Um, next up, I guess we should try this. This roof piece. I've actually got... Actually, I've got a uh, plan for that, so we won't do that immediately. Instead, what we're going to do is... um, We're going to select these. Edge. We'll select that. You'll see what I'm doing in just a sec. That, that. Yeah, just give me a... So what are we doing with this? Simple. We're going to see... I'm going to quickly... Actually, first I'm going to save scene and see if this works. Bevel. It's take a little bit. So I'm right. Should, should work. Check if that's fine. You want to quickly check around to see if I've accidentally created, an, accidentally created any end guns or anything. Which... Uh, 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 got a problem here. We'll unselect that, select that, make sure that was selected. Then we'll try everything again, because this seemed to work. What we're going to do, make the fraction very small. Something like that. And select this. And we'll select this, we'll go mesh. Clean up, we just want to select faces with more than full size. It did select two faces, okay. What faces have got more than four sides? Ah, I see it right, 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 right. We just delete those, don't need them. Wait, yes we do, never mind. No, I know what to do. Uh, what I'm going to do, go back to the whole object, control 1. 
And we're going to, what we're going to do, we're going to multi-cut. We're going to select this piece, this, enter, this, this, enter. We're going to go over here, multi-cut, here, whoops, here, enter, here, here, enter. There we are. Perfect. That's good looking. That's good looking. Right. It's like this. Like this one. I'm gonna do the exact same. Oh, gonna do the exact same thing. Like so. Like so. this one should be a lot shorter. And select bevel like so. Make the fraction uh, small to about the same. Yeah, about that. Like that. Multi cut. Select. Actually, we're just gonna make sure I select that, like that. Enter, like that. Ah, nope, not that. It's like that. Enter. Move it over here. So we select that face, cut edge, vertex, like that vertex, that vertex, like that vertex. Now, what we need to do is select these two. Mesh, clean up, select, by Hey, nothing was selected. All right, cool. No end guns. No end guns. So yeah, making real good progress. I'm very happy right now. I'm very happy. <sighs> this. Hmm. I think I want to save again. Save scene. Yes. I want to try something. I'm going to try beveling this edge and s these edges and see if it works. Bevel. Okay, so it looks like that. Mesh. Clean up. Apply. Alright, cool. Basically make it slightly more round, makes it more real. Those can be those can be hard though edges. That's fine. All right, cool. <sighs> dear, dear, dear. Okay. Just trying to think of what I'm going to do next in this. I mean, this will be the simplest thing to do here. Select object. Move it over. Move it over. Smaller. Move over. Move in. Smaller. Downwards. I'm going to make it. Gonna make it the same height as that, so Oops. there we go, like so. Select the face, delete it. Uh, like that. This face. Oh God. Select this face. Move it all the way upwards into into that. Yep. Got one face delete. Like so. Just need to add one, two, three. 
you will bevel those slightly make that 0 0.05 yeah like so there we are nice and if we mesh clean up clean up nothing selected brilliant right select all of that just delete its history and free transformations just to work it all out nice 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 <sighs> trying to breathe and stay calm I'm trying to think of what to do next actually hmm Mm hmm mm hmm So I think I am going to end the stream here. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do next and I'm slightly having a moment so I'm just gonna file save save turn this back on so yeah no another short stream after so long of not being here I know it's not very good but I'm making progress the fact that I'm streaming at all is a big step for me you probably wouldn't understand but it is so yeah, basically again I'll be uploading this to my YouTube channel so you can watch all the archive stream of this stream and all the other streams there I will try to stream again tomorrow, but I'm not sure, you know, if that will end up happening because I've been so unreliable, but I will try my best to do it. So, yeah, thank you again for all for watching, and goodbye.